Okay, Matthew, um, do you know the feed? Disappointment? Of course it is, yeah. Um, we're going for a league title, we didn't play like a team, we're going for a league title and uh, Obviously, I've kept them in the dressing room there for a little while, which I don't normally do, if I'm honest with you. Normally, you know, we normally think about it, watch the game back and, and concentrate then for next week. But I just thought some things that have crept into our play and our performance over the last couple of weeks, even including the, the good wins we've had, I've not been happy with. And uh, we feel we have to nip that in the bud in terms of mentality. Uh, the league's not won by a long stretch. Um, we're not home and host. And I think maybe some of the performances, not just out there, on the training pitch, haven't been up to the required standard that is going to get us where we need to be. Um, and it's not nice, they don't like being told, and you know, I didn't like being told myself as a player, but home truths are sometimes best, and it's better getting them out of the way now because we've still eight massive games to go. Um, we'll probably look back at the highlights and we probably had loads of chances, but I don't, it's not that I don't care because obviously we want to score goals. We should be coming out of the box doing what they've done. To us, they've nothing to play for them. They've not can't even get in the top six. And they come out and score a goal within a minute and then they kind of get on top of us and it's a moment to climb at 2-0. Just felt we huffed and puffed the whole night without creating any real quality. You know, we had chances, but it never looked like we were going to get on the end of it. And, and I was disappointed uh, more than I've ever been as manager of this football club in two years. Yeah. So it seemed like one of the nights where nothing would fall your way or was it just we weren't forced? No, you've to got to make it fall your way. I'm not one of them, I was just having forward all my days. You make things fall your way, you know. And I know you, you can come out and you can say, oh, we could have played till tomorrow and not scored. We wouldn't have. You've got to need to score a goal. You've got to go and put your body there. It's all right scoring when you're five up. That's when it's important. Go there, go and you know, gamble on things. Go and anticipate where the ball's going to drop so you can get on the end of it. But we just didn't do enough of that, I don't think, over the course of the game. We move on to the dub next week. Here's yeah. Time. And look, they're fighting for their lives now. Um, every game, it doesn't matter who we play, is going to be a tough game. Regardless, it's Pearson and then it's Dundalar away, where historically we, you know, it's always been tough to play. Then we've New Year here, who still have aspirations to get in the top six, and then it's going to be the split. You know, every game is a tough game. There's no point dressing it up because we've been beaten now in the last five games. We've been beaten away at Derby, drew with Ard, and then being beat at home against Ballyclare. That's not the form of champions. Um, so today the line gets drawn under it and we go back to training next week and we make sure that everything is fully focused on the PS9 game because they've had an upturn in fortunes uh, since the two guys have gone in, um, Glenn and Chris. They've, they've turned them around and I've seen them a couple of times and they've done really well with them. I'll go and watch them tomorrow at Knockbreeder and hopefully we can take something from it. I went to watch Barney Clare on Tuesday. That, I don't know them 11 weren't the players that played against Knockbreeder on Tuesday. We have to deal with that. As a club and me as manager and the players have to accept that the fact is, it doesn't matter what they do the week before or the week after, when they play us, it, it'll be a big game. And we have to quickly grasp that. I thought we'd grasped it all this season long. I just think in the last couple of weeks we've drifted off that uh, mentality. Um, with a bit of luck after what we spoke about tonight, that mentality will be uh, washed away with and we'll be ready to go. Thank you. Cheers. All right.